later. And could he be the next drama star to make it big in the pop charts? We'll see. Danny Seward, who plays uh, singer Joe Beresford in Where the Heart Is, will be here to tell us about uh, his exciting new album and having a bit of a sing-song as well, I think. In yeah, the today. next Robson, apparently. Robson That's Jordan, he wrote a couple of them himself, which is good. Okay, but first when record bosses first heard this man sing on the show Where the Heart Is, a recording contract swiftly landed in the lap of Danny Seward, who plays Joe Beresford. Morning. Good morning. Now, this uh, factory worker from the show has um, got himself a first album. I can't believe it. It's wonderful, isn't it? You and me both. Well, it's fantastic How news. How did this all happen? Well, um, kind of last series when, when they were making it, and um, the actors, we kind of get our scripts three weeks before they, they shoot yeah. it. And um, I literally opened two episodes, and there I was bursting into song. <laughs> and uh, I thought, what's going on here? Because obviously I sing and write and play the piano. But um, I'd never told anyone in the acting business <clears throat> excuse me, that that's what I do. So to get this in the script was great because I thought, if I can showcase this now and kind of show my voice off, hopefully someone might be watching. Yeah. And well, um, We're all going to watch now. We're going to have a look. This is from the first series. Have a look. Here's Danny. Or I'll never fall in love. It's cold, it's wet and it's free. As long as it's free, that's all right. It's a lovely place behind here. This Love has ended before it's begun. And too many moonlight kisses seem to cool in the warmth of the sun. See, that's where you find out whether you're talented or not. Yeah. Can you carry on? That was Anna and David's wedding, wasn't it? It was, yeah, yeah. It was, it was nice as well because the audience kind of follow those two characters. And, um, you know, when they got married, it was great to be asked to sing at their wedding. So. How many takes? Tell me the truth. Um, how many takes? What, with the beer exploding? Yes. Um, well, well we the whole thing, really. I mean, was the song... I mean, do you, can you just knock songs off straight away like that and it's perfect each time? Um, on that, I wanted to do that song, actually, because... Um, I got a choice to pick which songs I wanted to do, and because um, I play the piano, I kind of made the background track as well. So, all that was me on there. So, uh, yeah, yeah, it took about three takes. Yeah. Do you think the Do you think the producers um, almost were quite sorry that you were actually quite good? Because if they didn't know you could <laughs> sing, maybe they were hoping you were going to make a hash of it, and it would be a big joke. Yeah, um, takes. <laughs> I don't. I don't when, when they wrote me in, I don't think that they um, they thought that I was taking it seriously. It was just another storyline. Ah. But, um, but, um, but you yeah. proved them wrong. So you were in a Queen tribute band. This is where I'm just oh, no. oh no, 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 we, no. We what don't are you have doing with this question. We don't. <laughs> we don't have video footage. We had Anita Dobson in here yesterday, and right. she's obviously married to Brian May. Yeah. You know the guitarist. A massive Queen fan, me. Yeah. yeah. Oh, this is so. where it all started, wasn't it? Was yeah. it? You were Freddie, weren't you? <laughs> no, I wasn't Freddie. Were you there? Well, no. you, okay. I, well, I was Freddie, but without the singing bit. I was the keyboard player. Were you? And um, but the band was terrible. The yeah. band was terrible. Really. It didn't last that long, did it? Well, the guy looked like Freddie Mercury. He was this spitting image. When, you, when I saw him, I thought, oh, my God, because I'm a massive Queen fan. And I thought, please sing like him. And yes. then he, he opened his gob and he was terrible. So. <laughs> <laughs> Acting or singing, if you had to make a choice now, I know this is very fresh. You've been in yeah. Where the Heart Is Now for, what, three, for well, second year, isn't it? Yeah, um, no, year. fourth, fourth Four? Oh, great. Oh, yeah. sorry. I'm taking yeah. time flies when you're having fun. It does. But if you had to choose one path to take, what would it be? Well, si simply put, Where the Heart Is put me in the position that I'm in now. You know, mm. so I'd, I'd like to keep every door open. Mm. Um, if you shut the door on the acting, especially a show like that, you know, then you're shutting your door and, and everything that, you know, that it stands for. And I've been there four years. Well, I'll tell you somebody who did make it is in Where the Heart Is Now. Denise Van Outen has yeah. joined you, hasn't she? Yeah. Has she had anything to say about your blossoming career? Um, <clears throat> basically, I, I sat, as soon as I saw Denise, I know she's beautiful anyway, but... Well, look at her in a nurse's outfit, my goodness me. <laughs> See, she's nice, isn't she? Yes. <laughs> Yeah. Yes. She lit, stop ogling. And Sorry. Yeah. I know, yeah. I work with her every day and I'm still staring at her picture. She's so talented, isn't she? She is. She's good. And uh, the thing is as well, she's, you know, she can do anything. She can lend her hand to anything. She's a singer. She's a, you know, a dancer. Fantastic actress. Mm. And I think people are constantly surprised by what she does, you know. Yeah. But um, I sat her down and said, right, come on, tell me about the music industry then. What's it like? And she told you the truth. She told me the truth. <laughs> it's, it's pretty rugged, isn't it? It's no, it's rugged. just, a, you know, you've got to work hard. If you want to be at the top and I want to get to the top, okay. you've, got to, you've got to graft. All right, well, you're ready to graft. Uh, Danny, um, July the 25th, the album out, what's it uh, called? Another no, July the 18th. July the 18th. It's actually okay. uh, four days away. Okay. <laughs> Wish you the very best of luck with that. Where the heart is, nine o'clock, isn't it? Sunday night? Uh, eight eight o'clock. I've got night. everything wrong so far. <laughs> <laughs> right, it's eight o'clock, where the heart is. <laughs> Thank you, pardon. The very best of luck to you. Thanks Thank for you. coming in this morning. Do you want to introduce Andrew? Are you scared it actually might be Claire Nazir yeah, this morning? Yeah, uh, here's Claire up at St Andrews. OK.
for the welcome back. Still to come this morning, Danny Seward was such a hit singing in the TV series Where the Heart Is. He managed to get himself a record deal and he's here to perform a song from his new album shortly. And we talk to record well. executives also heard Danny Seward singing in Where the Heart Is. They quickly signed him up to make an album. Let's see him in action as Joe Beresford serenading the women. What is he doing here? There we go. Oh. <laughs> I can't believe it. Right, well, I am sorry about this, Julie, but this one's for you. And for you, Michelle, for giving me the guts to do it. I've got you under my skin. <laughs> oh. I've got you deep in the heart of me. So deep in my heart that you're really and Danny joins me now. You were saying, oh no, don't show him a clip. You don't like to watch yourself. A lot of actors are like that, they don't like yeah. to watch themselves. It's true. But I tell you what, huge response when you first sang. When you first sang in Where the Heart Is, was that mm. with Maureen Lipman or is that the second time? No, that was, yeah, the first, the first time. The first time was, yeah. Was Maureen Lipman. That's right. And then you sang again, didn't you, on your own? Yeah. Well, uh, it was because of the Maureen Lipman clip that, that I all started to. So and did they know it. you were a singer before they asked you to do it with it? I don't know, singing, you know. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure because as, as actors get our scripts like three weeks uh, before, it, before it films and I open mine and literally my character just starts bursting into song in the right. scripts. Now ITV probably just wanted to make a different kind of a storyline. Right. But in my mind, because I want to get into singing, I ah, thought this is, this is perfect. a nice opportunity. Couldn't have worked out better, absolutely. Yeah. And obviously, you know, it's going down very, very well because mm. the, the, the series out. Fantastic, Where yeah. My Heart Is, it's called. I like that. Where My Heart Is. Where are you? <laughs> there you are. Look, isn't that lovely? <laughs> nice picture. Thank you. Lovely picture, Danny. It's really, really good. It's excellent. You're following in the footsteps of many people who have done this. You know, likes of Robson Green have done it, Jerome Flynn, people mm. like that. Kwame's done it as well. Yeah. Um, are you worried in any way of the kind of old actor turned singer thing? But um, well, I'm as cynical as, as everybody in the media. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm one of those. I mean, you know, the first thing people are going to think is, oh, God, here we go again. You know, another mm. Robson Jerome, you know. Actually, it's, it's as, as far removed from, from that sure. as possible. Because and it's you've like, been singing for a while, for a yeah, long, long time. Music, and, music and acting have been kind of like side by side for you, haven't they? Yeah, well, I write and I, you know, I sing and play the piano and yeah. stuff. Because there's um, your own stuff in here yeah, as well. Actually, it? I've written the song Where My Heart Is, which is the uh, title track of the album. Oh, so. excellent. That's really good, because that's yeah. the key, isn't it? Yeah. It's all very well doing cover versions. Absolutely fine. You know, if you, you yeah. can bring yourself, a bit of yourself into that. Yeah. But it's if you write your, your own material. I think so. I think it gives you... Well, there's you. Ah, I just popped up out of nowhere again. <laughs> you look good. You look very, very good and you look very comfortable actually. You look as if you've been doing it for a long, long time. Is it true you were in a Queen tribute band? Um, it was, yeah, when I was... When <laughs> oh dear, twice on the show you've asked me that question now. Um, yeah, when I, was, when I was 15 I kind of, I was doing the rounds and stuff and trying to, right. trying to get into singing and acting. Um, but the, the Queen band were, were a bit crap. <laughs> <laughs> but that's all right. You've yeah. got to learn. You're yeah, you are a baby, and that's fine. I think it's a bit arrogant to think you can make a Queen tribute band and make it sound as good as Queen. You know. I don't think anybody can do that. Do no. Can they? I mean, I'm a massive fan. I loved Freddie Mercury. <sighs> I'm a, one of I'm, the greats, the all-time yeah, greats. I love me. Freddie Mercury, but they're doing they're reforming again, aren't they? Queen? I know they are. No, they're yeah. out. They're out doing concerts, which is yeah. really, really, really good. I think they're absolutely. Fantastic. Yes. Now, in Where the Heart Is, and the good thing about Where the Heart Is, uh, on a Sunday mm. night you can sit there and watch that. It's got the feel-good factor, which, let's be honest, we could all do with right now, that's mm. for yeah. sure. Yeah, that's a good, and, that's and a good point, actually. It, it really does. Yeah. You c it's kind of like, it's a safe, cosy world. I know, I know yeah. bad things happen there, but it, you know it's all going to be fine at the end. <laughs> you, you just do. You know, it's, know. it's just, it's very, very good. Yeah. And Denise Van Outen has joined recently. She joined last week, didn't she? Yeah, they, yeah. they keep doing it every series. They keep pulling in, like, big faces and, um, sure. you know, and it's a big show. It gets 8 million viewers. And, um, it's doing very, very well. And I know that you two have sat down and talked because obviously, you know, she's brought out records before, she's done musical theatre. Yeah. Did she give you any advice or just any help? Um, yeah, she has. Well, I've sat her down and asked her, like, how, how, how to be a pop star. <laughs> <laughs> and she basically says, you know, there's a lot of work involved. Yeah. You know, you've got to promote yourself and get out Absolutely. there. Absolutely. And, um, but, you know, it's, it's fun as well. And if you really want to do mm. it, and I, re I do really want to do it, you know, it's my, my big passion, so. Excellent. Yeah. And you think you'll be able to run, because at the moment it's the two things that are running side by side, aren't they? Yeah. And that's quite difficult because you're absolutely right, you <clears> do have to work hard. I think yeah. a lot of the, the, the little ones that want to be in pop idol and, you know, they want, they want to do it because they want to be famous, yeah. have absolutely no idea of how hard no. you've got to graft. You don't just sit there going to celebrity openings yeah. and drinking champagne. Precisely, <laughs> I know. You know. Well, it, the thing is, I mean, it's, it's kind of all come around this year and I've been making the album, I've been in the series and they've put me to the test, you know, and I've, right. we've done it, we've managed to get it all done, so... Uh, if anyone said to me, what would you rather do, I'd, I'd, I'd like to do both. Yeah, 
Too I've right. done both and I can, it's possible. Exactly, it, yeah. absolutely. We're going to hear you performing later on. Yes, you are. It's lovely to see you. Yeah. It really is. Lovely to meet you. Cheered yeah. us up. Thank you very much, Danny. Thank you. Oh. Now, do you remember yesterday? We showed you how Are you entertaining or something? Hopefully. All oh, right. I'll make myself scarce then, shall I? Um, is it anyone I know? You. If you like. And you're free. <laughs> Well, I'll have to check in my diary, but I'm pretty sure I am. Yes! So and of course the star of the...